Long time no see for at least me because I have not sat down and filmed a video in about two weeks because my last couple of videos that I've uploaded actually have been pre-recorded because I was on vacation in Hawaii for 10 days. Um, I've also just come home and I'm getting a cold. So that is absolutely lovely. I had an absolute blast on my holiday. I haven't been on vacation in seven years, so this was an absolute amazing time for me to actually not really do a lot of work. I didn't look at a ton of comments. I did do some things here and there, but I did not do nearly as much as I do when I'm at home, um, and that was just great. We also had weather of just 27 degrees every single day. Um, and that was amazing. I missed home so much though. I missed mainly just the pets. Now that I am home and it's minus 40 every day, not, not so much missing home. Kind of, kind of want to go back. While I was in Hawaii, my friend actually had gone with me and we went ahead and we got matching tattoos while we were there. So this is a koi fish and my friend got one as well and so when we put our arms together it looks kind of like the fish are swimming in a circle like a yin, yin and yang and a lot of people are probably wondering victoria i'm surprised you didn't get a hamster as your first tattoo because you love hamsters <laughs> but no hamsters are not my entire personality and for me personally i really just don't want like a hamster face or head tattooed on me. I do eventually want to get something that is hamster related, like a really tiny hamster paw print. I think that would be really cute, but this one is just special because it was done in Hawaii specifically. Now, enough about me because you're probably not here for me, but you guys haven't seen the pets in quite a while. I had a pet sitter for 10 days looking after the entire bunch. So let's go check out all of the pets and see how they've been doing. So a while ago, I got these scammin, salmon, <laughs> salmon fish skins from Pet Value, and the cats absolutely love these. I have to show you guys how they react. Look at Jay. Um, it's just dried fish, uh, salmon fish skin. So, oh gosh. So it's just like rolled up tight, and it's really good for the cats chewing. Like they just, they really like chewing it. Here you go. Yeah. You love your salmon skin. Oh, it's so crunchy. Oh. The cats also are doing really good. Um, my pet sitter took really great care of them and they didn't seem to really miss me that much. Um, when I got home and opened the door, they did come running but they were just like who the heck is this woman and just sniffed me and then we're like okay feed us <laughs> i like to say that sadie probably missed me quite a bit because i am her person but i also think she was doing okay without me here for just a little bit <laughs> And here are the rabbits. Here's Cleo in her hay, uh, in the hay. <laughs> and Lola, come here. And here's Lola. So both of the rabbits are doing really great. My pet sitter did a really good job at uh, just cleaning their room and just doing all the stuff that the rabbits need. The rabbits, I would say, are literally the hardest pet to keep up with just because they are really messy. So it is a lot of work for somebody to come here and like clean out their room because Cleo's long haired, she gets hay everywhere. When they jump out of the box, poop flies out of the box. So the room gets messy within a couple of hours after cleaning it. Um, Do you want another treat? Okay, one more treat. Ready? 
Oh, this is a big one. Ready? Sink. And for you, Lala. Oh, I dropped it. Look. Click. Did you think? Good job! Oh! Hey, did you miss me? Oh no, you're all staticky. <laughs> what is it? Okay, the humidity in this room is 17%. That's because it's freezing outside. Um, and so my furnace has to be running more frequently when it's freezing outside, obviously. So um, that just comes with cold weather. It is a lot of static electricity. <laughs> Lola's looking like really scruffy on her face. You can't really see unless you're up close, but she's starting uh, to molt. In February, they usually do start like a little bit of a molt. Rabbits tend to molt like either two to four times a, ye a year. It honestly depends on the rabbit because I know some rabbits don't really molt a ton. And then some rabbits are just, they're constantly molting. Um, but Lola is getting really scruffy on her face, so I really want to pluck them, but she won't let me. Hey. So it is currently 7 p.m. and Miss Mabel is awake. She's the first one out of the bunch to be awake. Um, I don't know if you guys can really tell. Mabel isn't looking the greatest. Um, you can just really tell in her eyes that she's just aging and I think it's kind of hitting her a little hard right now. Do I treat? There you go. <laughs> she hasn't been eating as much food as she used to and she's definitely not as active um, but there's nothing really we can do. Uh, her cancer, sus her suspected cancer diagnosis was back in October and Cleo just a binky into the litter box and so any extra time that is spent with Mabel I am extremely grateful for honestly and yeah that is that's Mabel the next hamster that is awake is Waddles <laughs> he is also doing really really well oh my goodness Waddles <laughs> Tell everyone how you're doing. Waddles really does not have any updates because Waddles is just, Waddles is Waddles. Waddles is the immortal boy. Um, but yeah, that's that's Waddles. There's literally, ugh, there's nothing to talk about him because he's just, it's Waddles. Like he's, he's immortal. Nothing has ever happened to him. Um, he lives his life. Um, he doesn't age at all. Literally, he looks exactly the same as when I got him. So, he's chewing on my zipper. It's lovely. What else, what are you trying to do? Are you trying to eat my, are you trying to eat the sweater? You can't. I'm sorry, I know it's very soft, but you can't eat it. Oh, you're so soft. Hey, did you even know I was gone? Probably not. Probably not. <laughs> you can't eat this. It's not edible. You can't use it for nesting, I'm sorry. All right, well, that's all about Waddles. Literally, no change, just same boy, right? Same boy, same little noodle. Good morning, oh, you're so sleepy. Good morning, good morning, meet the Dipper. So Dipper is also doing pretty good. Um, his back nails definitely do need to be trimmed a little bit, so I'm gonna tr try to do that um, within the next couple of days. But I think his front feet are actually doing not too, too, too bad. I know his one nail is growing, it's growing weird. It's growing like back up, upwards. Like, <laughs> I don't know why. But with his um, getting older, he has decided that his nails are gonna be all funky dunky. Yes you do, of course you do. Oh my goodness. You're gonna have two treats. Whoa. Well, you're doing pretty well, so I don't know how much else I can um, talk about <laughs> for you either. You and Waddles are just 
Doing really good, hey? Besides your nails. <laughs> You're so cute. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Too much. Too much. Your hair's all messed up now. Oh, you're gonna comb yourself. Oh, wish wash. Well, that's Dipper. Um, so that pretty much concludes today's video. I hope you guys have enjoyed seeing all of the pets. All of them are doing really great, um, with the exception of Mabel, of course. But other than that, my pet sitter did an amazing job while I was gone and I really had no worries while I was gone because I really did trust her um, for good reasons. <laughs> so I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!